Hey guys, this is Chris Bliss. Today we're going to do the side quest without a trace. we got to go talk to the herbalist who lives just outside of Oxenfurt. Uh, this is part six of my Witcher walkthrough series. Whoa, what is this? Whoa, what the heck is happening here? Uh, I hope that this goes away. We'll see when the quest starts. But anyway, this is like the sun is following me. I have no clue. I have no idea. Ever since... Uh, the 1.1 update it's been a little different I don't really know what's going on with it's like some of the cutscenes take a little bit longer to load or like there's a lot of texture pop in or during conversations uh, there's like pop in and then it stops and then it has to load a little bit but uh, let's see what's happening in this cutscene Alright. A boar. I don't know why. Between its ribs, it was being Dude. hunted. Something went horribly wrong, so though. Wrong, okay. Well, let's get this stuff. It's kind of weird how there was a cutscene for a boar. But before I go on to the herbalist, yeah, ever since 1.1, the update, there feels like there's been a lot of different uh, kind of problems. I mean, you guys just saw, like, the shadow of the sun kind of just coming up through my screen. And the conversations it just feels like there's been a lot of pop in and texture pop in and a little loading times a little bit longer. So, uh oh, let's see these guys. Let's get Igni out. The flaming, the flaming rose, I think they're called. Flaming order. I'm wearing their armor. Some kind of a hypocrite. Uh, let's try Ard. There we go. A little bit better. I find Ard to be a little bit better against the shield guys. I'm not sure why he's on fire. Oh my goodness. I find Ard to be a little bit better against the shield guys. Knocks him back a little bit more. Let's use a Thunderbolt. Man, this guy with the big, uh, I don't even know what you call it, hammer. I must have a, a rune on my sword that causes them to burn. I don't remember putting something like that on there, though. Whoa. Alright, let's be a little bit careful. Let's take another swallow. I don't want to have to restart all this. Alright, that should be good to go. Let's wait for our to charge up again. There we go. Oh, I'm stuck in this garden. What the heck? There we go. Let's end this. Oh, come on. One more. Ugh, his shield. Ugh. This, you can tell how I'm not very good. Alright, this will get him. There we go. Ooh, right with the arm off. Alright, let's see what's going on. Let's get a sword. The herbalist, he's still in. He's still inside. They're trying to get us home. Hmm. It was rather efficient. Now all you got to say is I saved your life. We'd have disposed of that rabble easily. We? My, I'm be precise. You know what I mean. Now, are you here to trade or not? Hmm? Trade? Uh... Well, let's let's take a look and see what he has so far. Let me have a look. If he has any good potions. 
Anything could. Uh, cursed oil. Deridium bomb. I think I already have that. Uh, what's this? Doppler. Creases. Let's get these two right here. I got. The, I already have these ones, I think. Alchemy. Can I make anything? Let's see. I don't think I can make anything. Oh, Grave Hag decoction generates vitality. Let's get that. Wyvern. Attack power until the fight ends. Alright, not bad. Let's see. I think then that's it. Alright. Let's Yarrow Extract. Yarrow Extract. I do. In the back. Follow me. In a secret dungeon. I have a feeling. Okay, it may not be a trap. Stranger. It was a trap. You've come. Good. It remains to be seen. Aim to tell me something, I think. So talk. How do I put this? Oh yeah, this was the guy from the video last time. We both need to get into the boat, so these both. Both want something that's in there. Why not pool our strength? Sorry, Sorry but what exactly is yours? I have a plan. Spent the last year working on it. On paper. Time to set it in motion. You want us to count on. Let's get some more information. The vault. What's in there for you? Something that was stolen from me. Mm. How'd I go to the city watch, tell them a crime's been committed, not organize a heist? I've tried. Repeatedly. I see. Cheated by the system, wronged by the world. Doesn't matter. What did they take? Wish to take a good while. So I'd rather change the subject. You in or not? Let's see. Let's get some more. Before we go any further, we even know what Max Brasotti's house is. I know it's in the vault. Didn't answer my question. Neither of you. Willing to help with the heist or not? Come on. I don't even know your name. What's that matter? It matters because you're clearly hiding something. Not just from me, either. Wouldn't be sitting in a cellar in the shit all otherwise. We've all some state on our conscience. But I've not asked for your hand in marriage. Just for your help in a heist. We break it. Each take what we need. They go our own way. Try to trick me any way, anyhow. You won't go anywhere. You know that? Because I'll take your head off right where it meets your neck. I'm aware of the risks. So now that you've threatened me and all, are you in? Or are you not? I, uh, I'm no thief, I guess. I'm not a thief. It's opportunity makes the thief, would you? I speak from experience. <sighs> Talk. Twenty Redanian soldiers guard the auction house, day and night. Patrols walk in circles around it, and here, past this corner, Max. Brute force is out. Gotta get in quietly. Exactly. Not the simplest thing, though. Main entrance, army door, windows, dining room bars. But not a fortress out there without a weakness. This one, this one's no different. Patience happens to be my weakness, so dispense with the dramatic pauses and talk. <clears throat> Beside the house stands a tower from which we can enter the attic. We can't hope to enter the tower from this street on account of the patrols, but there's a window 60 feet off the ground. Nope. We've got to get up there and sneak across to the auction house, then down the stairs to the cellar, crack open or blow off the vault door, and voila! Huh. Well. 
Eh, I don't really think that's a. Eh, let's go with this one. Looks bleak to me. Tower wall is smooth as glass. Don't know about you, but I can't scale that. And I've not asked you to. Let me finish. For this to work, we need two more accounts. One to scale the tower, drop us a line. The other to open the vault. A safe cracker, but a demolition specialist. I've already identified some promising candidates. All we have to do is select and recruit the best among them. Also your job. I'd uh, prefer to remain largely out of sight. Mm -hmm. Assumed as much given your hood. Anything else? I? Well, that's among the details. Which you will learn just as soon as you declare. Alright, I don't think I have much of a choice. <sighs> I don't really have any other options. So be it. I'm in, but on one condition, no one dies. That clear? As the great son of Nilfgaard. How about we knock back around? Show some mutually beneficial relationships. Rather get to work. What comes first? First, you have to assemble a crew. Then, there's the retaining patrols to cull a bit. Too many wandering around. Alright, let's... Calling the patrols. What's this about calling the patrols? Told you, no one dies. Easy. I don't want anyone's death. Just need some folk to be temporarily indisposed. Spit it out. You got to approach the garrison's cook. Convince him to spite the soldiers' nosh with something to keep some of them bedroom. One in two. Formula for a potion that might do the trick. Then, see, brew up a bit of that, hit the town, find the cook, then convince him to do you a favor. I don't know, cast a spell, toss him some coin. You get all some easy faces. All right, opening the vault. All right, opening the vault. Who do we have? Let's start with the fact that one of them's a dwarf. Casimir Bassi, native of Mahakas. A specialist in controlled explosions. Folks say he could blow Novograd to the high heavens with a pinch of salt meat. Vote door for him. Just. The problem is, Casimir apparently hung off his detonators some time ago. He married, sired some littler ones, and settled in the village of Almas. Mind playing turns down. Any options? Quinto, the North's most famed safe cracker. Arrest warrants out on him in Kedwin, Lyria, Angrin, and Kavir. Certainly <laughs> got nabbed a few days back by one Hans of Sidaris. A trick mercenary. As far as I know, his troops made camp east of Oxenfurt on the right bank of the Punta. <sighs> so I'd have to rip one from his cozy home, the other from a cozy cage. Need to think about it. Break-in artists. Tell me about them. Assuming lack of vertigo to be the first requirement. Precisely why my favorite ever line gallow. A circus artist, no better is <laughs> Just now performing with a troupe somewhere near Oxford first. Speciality. <laughs> Breaking and entering. Not official. The router troops taken with a list of the most audacious thefts in recent years. Perfect match. I would doubt that's a coincidence. But it is reluctant with another option in Hugo Hoff, alias Beef Patty. A half -wing. Think he's fit? Pudgy face. Doesn't really match my image of a criminal. You'd be surprised. Hugo's notched up more break-ins than you felt monsters. More importantly, two years past, he nicked a gold-plated cock from the roof of the town all in no So, yeah. Word has it, he's holed up in Oxenfurt, in a house near the Nova Grand Gate. Be careful. It's modest in size, but apparently wicked dangerous. Alright, let's go get him. All right, I'm off. Got a bit to do. As do I. Get it all done, and we'll meet back here. What then? Then we'll bug a horse up 
down and sideways, all together. All right, let's see. Let's get out of here. How do I get... Go up. Up. Use. There we go. Jeez. All right, let's... I think there's one other thing we gotta talk to the herbalists hey, about. Hey there. Hear about the contract. Whew. A take at long last. Poverty in everyone's lips, but when you've a job to give, no one's eager. Folks are lazy, that's the truth of it. Stick to the point if you don't mind. Uh, right, right, right. Sorry for the chatter. I'm anxious, is all. Been so long without any what. <sighs> it's my apprentice, Falkert. I sent him to the dead white wood. You know, the forest near Martin Foy's farmstead. I I'd run out of hand fiber, see, and the, the damned stuff grows thick as weeds there. Let me guess. Hasn't returned. Yes. Uh, uh, no, he hasn't. Please, find him and bring him back safe and sound. All right, we'll look for him. No promises, but I can certainly look for him. Any distinguishing features? How will I recognize him? Hmm. Got to think on that. Well, he's a, a halfling, as I am. A light hair. Will that do? It'll have to. So long. So long. Alright, let's take a look. We got the herbalist without a trace. Still have to do that one. Well, let's... Let's go with this one. Without a trace. It'll take us a while to get there. Let's see if it's close. Mmm... Not really. We'll have to go as close as we can and see if we could find him. All right, let's. Where's Roach? What are you doing all the way down there? All right, let's go see if we could find the herbalists. The halfling. Hidden treasure? Uh, no, I'll do that later. Let's find this halfling. Look for Fulcrich tracks in the dead wood, dead right, dead white wood, using your Witcher sense. Alright. Let's get off. Let's see if we could find them. Let's just go straight in the middle and see. And to find his tracks. Oh, here's something. It's like a crashed wagon. Herbalist's cart. Got some blood here. Follow the blood track. Oh, here it is. Blood. Uh-oh. A few days old. That's not good. Erd. Erdy. Feeling it's gonna be. Let's look at this. Trail's gone cold. Oh, I don't like the look of this. Let's take a potion in case. Maybe someone's seen him. Ask the inhabitants about Folkard. 
Alright, here's some people up here. To these parts, Master. Lost your way. Lost your way? No, looking for someone. Ah. Do tell. Perhaps we can help. Looking for someone, looking for someone named Fulkert. Light haired halfling. Ring any bells? Aye. Saw a little one round here. Out picking herbs. Mm -hmm. Till he got hurt. Ran across a trail of blood. Trail led me here. Just as you say. Wolves had attacked him. He fled here seeking shelter. Back to your city, young master. Plenty such dangers hereabouts. But the fool was stubborn. Said he had to pick his blooms aforehand. Back into the woods. And back were the last of him. Heard howling that night, sent shivers down my spine. So where are his remains? Wolves would have left something. His boots, maybe. Go looking. But he's too old to go tramping about in the woods. Hmm. What is this place exactly? A village. Plain to see. Abandoned huts is about all I see. Aye. It's only us now. Young folk I don't think that's right. Right as rain. All right. I think they're lying. So long. Report back to the herbalist. Huh. Interesting. That's it. I kind of figured we'd go look for him. Use our Witcher sense or something. That can't be it, though. There has to be something else. Those people in the village didn't really seem like they were all there. All right, let's go talk to the herbalists and tell them. Volkert, your apprentice. I know what happened to him. Out with it. I've gone near daft with worry. Found some witnesses. Found some witnesses. Claim wolves attacked him. He survived at first, then went back in the woods to harvest more herbs. His luck ran out. Ah. A treasure, that lad. Dutiful. Dutiful. Mannered. Such a shame. Well, here's your gold. Trust that it will serve you well. That was it? Huh. Interesting. I kind of figured there would be something more to that. Oh well. Alright, let's see what we're going to do next. In the next video. We'll cut this one a little bit short. Uh, Rose on a red field. Level 33. These are 34. In the next video, we'll do Rose on a red field. Oh, cheeky young woman. Yeah, we'll do Rose on a red field next since it's level 33. And the rest of these are level 34s. Alright, sounds good.